Hello friend, today we shall talk about a topic that how we can calculate communication channels. Friend, today's topic is very very interesting, especially if you have interest in project management or you are planning to give exam of PMP. Friend, let me tell you one very important point here that the question that uh, how to calculate communication channel, this is a very important question and you will definitely see this question in the uh, PMP exam. So uh, friend, uh, cal calculating communication channel in project management context is essential for understanding the complexity of communication within a team. The number of communication channels increase significantly as the number of team members increase making it important to manage these effectively. So let's talk about in detail. So what are the communication channel? Communication channels refer to the potential ways in which team members can communicate with each other. Each pair of team members represent a unique communication channel. Now here is the question that why it is important. Understanding the number of communication channels helps project managers and Anticipate the communication needs and potential challenges in the project such as information overload or miscommunication here as well. Now uh, we, we will discuss that how to calculate the communication channel. To calculate the number of communication channel we use the formula number of channel is equal to n into n minus 1 divided by 2. This is the formula and here the n is the number of team member. So breaking down the formula like n is the total number of team members n minus 1 each team member can communicate with n minus 1 other member and divided by 2 means that since communication between two members is bidirectional that means a to b is the same as b to a so we divide by 2 to avoid uh, counting each pair twice now uh, let's take an example of a very small team scenario a project team consists of four members so identify the number of member n is equal to 4 now applying the formula to calculate the number of channels so 4 into 4 minus 1 divided by 2 then 4 multiplied by 3 4 minus 1 divided by 2 and 4 into 3 is equal to 12 so 12 divided by 2 and now uh, 12 divided by 2 is equal to 6 so there are 6 communication channel in a 4 member team let's take another example of a larger team that uh, for example a project team consists of 10 team members so identify the number of members as n is equal to 10 now apply the formula 10 into 10 minus 1 divided by 2 10 into 9 divided by 2 okay 10 minus 1 then 10 into 9 is equal to 90 so 90 divided by 2 then number of channels is equal to 45 so there are 45 communication channel in a 10 team member then a uh, friend uh, visualizing the communication channel means to better understand the concept you can visualize it imagine each team team member as a dot and each communication channel as a line connecting the two dots four member team member uh, visualization means member a b c d so channels are a b a c a d b c b d and c d then team member uh, team visualization means A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J and the channels all possible unique pairs such as A, B, A, C, A, D and then so on I, J. Then friend in practice managing a large number of communication channels can be challenging and here are the uh, few tips which we should consider. First one is the structured meeting that means schedule regular meetings to ensure effective communication. This is very important so that everyone should be on the same page. Then centralized communication tools such as uh, use tools like Slack, Microsoft Teams or project management software to streamline communication. These softwares are very important in communication. Then clear roles and responsibilities means define roles clearly to reduce unnecessary communication. Documentation means keep thorough documentation to avoid repeating information and to ensure everyone has access to the same knowledge and on the uh, having the same knowledge. So uh, summary uh, if we talk about friend uh, communication channel means ways team members can communicate with each other the formula of uh, calculating the communication channel is equal to n into n minus 1 divided by 2 and then it helps in understanding and managing communication uh, complexity. Uh, here friend by calculating and managing the communication channels effectively project managers can improve the uh, team coordination okay and uh, it reduce the misunderstandings and enhance the overall project efficiency here as well here remember friend one thing that 
once the number of team member increase the number of uh, communication channel would also be increased and the communication would also become complex when the number of people are high or are more in the uh, in the team so friend thank you thanks a lot for watching the video